say thank you. Well, if your dance moves are out of style like mine or you just want a chance to show them off, we have an event for you coming up this week. This weekend, St. Matthew's House is working to raise more than a ton of food, literally a ton. And you can help while also putting your dancing shoes on. So Johnny and Lisa Permar join us live in the studio with more on this weekend's event this morning. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning. So thank you for coming in. We're really excited. This is a big three-day event this weekend. Can you tell us a little bit about what exactly this all is, the Hunger Ball? Okay. Well, um, it's called Will Dance for Food slash Hunger Ball. Mm -hmm. And on this coming Friday and Saturday, we are giving away 45-minute private lessons for anybody who brings two of these event bags okay. full of designated items to go to St. Matthew's house. And you two are professional ballroom dance instructors, so they're getting the real deal from you guys yeah. and spiffing up their moves right before the big event on Sunday night. Mm -hmm. We've been dancing for over 20 years. So. Wow. Married couple, dance partners as well. Yes. How exciting for you guys. So tell us a little bit about what we can expect for people to come out to you guys. What are we going to learn? Oh, good. Good. Uh, uh, well, you're going to have two days of 45-minute uh, lessons. You mm -hmm. come in, bring your designated food. Um, there is a designated food item list in uh -huh. each bag that they need. Um, of course, they'll take any, but uh, come in for your lesson and. Uh, but you can learn whatever you want. Okay. It could be sure. salsa, waltz, rumba, cha cha, anything whatever. Anything at all. Anything you anything want to work on. Wonderful. Okay, because there's so many different kinds. I'm sure that you guys know and can help people out with. Tell us a little bit about how you guys came up with this idea to help out St. Matthew's House. This was your idea. Well, yeah. <laughs> well, we were we were with another studio and we decided to break out on our own about two years ago, and uh, it was kind of scary to get on our own. And I said to her, uh, we might be on the side of the road with a cardboard sign that says we'll dance for food. Oh, just joking. Yeah. yeah. Scary business it venture. Was, anytime you it was. Right. And then once we realized we were going to be okay and everybody was behind us, uh, I said that would be a great idea for a charity event. So it just kept running through my head. So last year we did it and. Uh, we did it at the studio, and we had the ball there, and we raised over a ton of food. Literally, a ton. Uh, I think the yeah. last bag put us over by maybe eight or nine pounds. Wow, that's amazing. And yeah. St. Matthew's House is such a wonderful organization in our community, helping homeless and, and hungry people here in uh, southwest Florida. So we're hoping to raise as much food as possible. Of course, the, the non-perishable, the perishable items, I think they take everything. I think they take it all, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Any kind of donation. And we, you know what? We're, if you don't want the lesson, we will just take donations, mm -hmm. too. Okay. So if okay. your dancing skills are up to par, then fine. Wonderful. <laughs> okay, so people need to get in touch with you. How can they do that? They can call us, 239-919-0205. Uh, uh, we also have a website, johnnylisadance.com. Okay. And there's also a Facebook page for Will Dance for Food slash Hunger Ball. Okay, and all the information there on your screen okay. is regarding uh, the event on Sunday night. So, again, that's going to be held at St. John the Evangelist Catholic Church in North Naples on 111th Avenue. 6 to 9.30 is the actual Hunger Ball slash Will Dance for Food event. Those numbers there on your screen, you can reach out and contact anybody you need to get in touch with if you have any more questions about the event. And all of that information and everything you guys told us how to get in touch with you. We'll put that up on our okay. website, wakesnews.com, as well. But it sounds like such a wonderful event. I hope you guys get a lot of interest, a lot of people Thank coming you. out to help out. Thank you. So Thank you. We really hope so. Yeah. Thank yeah. you so much. Wonderful. Thank you guys again. We'll be right back with a check of your weather, traffic, and this morning's hot story here on Wake News this morning.